so in this video we are going to talk about modern ace and later we will be talking about georgian poetry dadaism surrealism so what is a modern ace it is uh, in simple words it is 20th century and period just after world war first but if you take the definition or in depth inquiry about uh, modern is so modern is or modernism involved a radical and conscious break with the past rejection of conventional victorian morality and invention of new forms of expression so what is what makes a uh, an is different from another is it is the forms of expression means you will find different expression forms of expression in victorian is different forms of expression in romantic is and in chaucer's is and so on so the foundation of the existing existing world order was shaken during the 20th century as we know that in victorian is there were a lot of development scientific development and all world order was shaken by world war first so faith was shaken jo ek vishwas tha logon ka लाइफ के प्रति वो चेंज हो गया था टोटली चेंज इट वाज टोटली चेंज्ड सो सेवरल सोशल इकोनॉमिक साइंटिफिक एंड कल्चरल एंड पॉलिटिकल चेंजेस टुक प्लेस सो दिस इज यू नो द बेसिक आइडिया अबाउट मॉडर्न एज एंड लेट्स टॉक अबाउट हियर मॉड गॉन डब्ल्यू बी इट्स एंड लीडा एंड सो ऑन सो दैट इज एक्चुअली जस्ट अ शॉर्ट नोट सो वर्ल्ड वॉर फर्स्ट वी नो सो वेन वी टॉक अबाउट literature and uh, a particular is so expressions comes and there are bunch of writers they have different faith and uh, different way of expressions so first is georgian poetry so georgian poetry denotes a body of poetry produced in england in early 20th century between 1912 and 1922 so you can take this short note for your uh, english literature exams and the aim of uh, georgian poetry gp georgian poetry was to revive public interest in poetry and inaugurate new poetic is now let's call let's go to the next note it is named after the reign of king george 5th who was crowned in 1910 and later we can talk about the oxford group dadaism dadaism was a literary and artistic movement that emerged in 1916 so it was 1916 when dadaism came into existence and surrealism so these are all the parts of modernist writing and these are way of expression we need to understand in order to understand what modernist writing is and what modern is is so surrealism 20th century literary and artistic movement it emerged in paris as a direct result of the publication of andre breton's manifesto so in in this video i would like to uh, you know draw your attention towards the way of making notes as well uh, you can make your notes in this way and that can help you a lot to make you know your concept about something so whatever concept you want to make so you will write down about that concept then you will write down the supportive concept or supportive writers their works and so on so that you will have each and everything there at one place to analyze what that thing is if in literature it is very difficult to you know understand some concepts so if you do such things and you have all the things together all together you will understand them better so let's go ahead here we have avant-garde so avant-garde literature rejects tradition and undertake to make it new so like ezra pound you might have heard about her so rejects tradition and undertake to make it new so avant-garde uh literature or the poets they wanted to do you know more experiments new experiments and new things in literature that's why the phrase came into existence to make it new imagism came uh, into existence in 
1912 it started advocated free words common speech patterns and so common speech pattern so this one words words thing you remember this thing okay he told that poetry must be uh, from you know common language of people language of common people okay so and clarity of expression through the use of precise visual images like Ezra Pound, Amy Lowell, Hilda Doolittle, HD, full form, Hilda Doolittle, Richard Adlington, and William Collis, William, W. Collis, William. So these people are, you know, in this group, Imagism. Dadaism, we have already talked about it, but let's go through some more notes. Literary and artistic movement emphasizes on illogical and irrational and uh, negate traditional artistic value and eschewed meaning so they dadaism they negate traditional artistic uh, values now let's go to surrealism it was literary and artistic moment manifesto on surrealism breton's andre so that was actually the work psychic automation revolt against all control and restraint through automatic writing self introduced induced hallucination and exploitation of dream or trance so that is the uh, you know introduction to um, the modern is so in if you want to know more about modern is uh, you can study all these things separately and you can dig more so hopefully you like the video if you like please don't forget to share the video thank you for watching bye bye take care see you in next video good luck